Good morning. Bye. Morning. 292. Lesson 292. A happy outcome to all things is sure. This is such good news. I love this. <laughs> a happy outcome to all things is sure. God's promises make no exceptions, and he guarantees that only joy can be the final outcome found for everything. Yet it is up to us when this is reached, how long we let an alien will appear to be opposing his. And while we think this will is real, we will not find the end he has appointed as the outcome of all problems we perceive all trials we see, and every situation that we meet. Yet is the ending certain, for God's will is done in earth and heaven. We will seek, and we will find according to his will, which guarantees that our will is done. Boy, the key right here is, and wh while we think this will, this alien will, is real, <laughs> um, we're not going to find this end that he has promised is sure, right? It's that... Happy um, outcome. Yeah, the happy outcome. We won't see the real world. We're not letting that circle of fear that we've imposed over our mind to be forgiven, uprooted, and, and um, dissolved, Right. So it's the arrogance of the ego. While that's running, all we're doing is staving off the inevitable, you know, that, that our will. Mm -hmm. Right. Trying to have, a, yeah. So all pain is just that, the rejection of a happy outcome. Yeah, the rejection of God. Rejection of God. And our rejection of our holy self. That's because God's will is our will. That's what we're coming to discover. But meanwhile, we're having this, you know, round of rebellion that says, I have a will apart from God and I can prove it. And I'm reacting to it all the time. So it must be real. Mm. Mm. Yeah. No. <laughs> okay. So forgiveness. All right. Um, the prayer. We thank you, Father, for your guarantee of only happy outcomes in the end. Help us not interfere and so delay the happy endings you have promised us for every problem that we can perceive, for every trial we think we still must meet. Mm. So uh, the first thing that I see in this is is of course the lesson is a happy outcome to all things is sure. But the, the qualification for that, <laughs> it's very simple, right? <laughs> Maybe not easy, but it's very simple. Yes. Is that everything I experience here in the dream of a body and a world, right? Mm -hmm. I give to Holy Spirit for his divine repurposing. Yes. So that's what speeds up the happy outcome. Mm -hmm. yeah. See it and give it over. See yeah. it and give it See over. It and give it over and just go, oh, I obviously wanted it. Otherwise, it wouldn't be happening. That's a tough one, isn't it? <clears throat> so, you know, I wanted it. First, yeah. Mm-hmm. It wouldn't be happening otherwise. And now I change my mind. Choose again. There it is right there. Yeah. Yeah. That's the simplicity of it. And then we make it really complicated by still thinking that this world and our will are real. Hmm. Keep thinking we have to try to make two, two opposites coincide or that something still needs to be done here. Yeah, but... You know, and it's it's just complete, total surrender and forgiveness of it all. I watch the mind turn around and want to take a bite. And it's just trying to catch it at that moment that the mind turns around and thinks that there's still something to do. Mm. Nothing to do but to forgive it. Mm. Really, because, I mean, there's a terror. I'm watching this. Mm -hmm. There's a terror. <laughs> 
from the ego's point of view, you know how you talk about I know mind, a mythical me, mm -hmm. this terror of becoming absolutely, eternally redundant. That's it. It'll go back to its greatest go-tos to take a scoop for its life. And, and I'm just like, I was talking to somebody else this morning and going, it just feels like, you know, I'm just being peppered because it really, it just, it's seeking any admittance into the thought. And you just sit there and you feel like you've got a swarm of bees around your head, but I could just hold still, <laughs> see the bees, hear the bees, <laughs> but I don't mean to use bees. I know you love your bees, but um, yeah, just to not react, mm -hmm. to realize that it's a dying ego thought system that is trying its damnedest to get you to 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 dance with it mm -hmm. very good sis i would use a, a different image i would yeah. use those yellow jacket hornets okay. <laughs> deal <laughs> yeah just anything that you find really <laughs> annoying or pestering yes those ones that dance around your food when you're trying to eat oh you guys anyway that just to notice like we're just this is what it turns into and when that time is arising just to recognize oh that's what this is for and i don't want this mm. i don't want the suffering that inevitably comes every time i think that there's still something left in that ego thought system that feeds me sustains me protects me gives me something i want Hmm. okay so there's the two pronger all th a happy outcome to all things is sure dot 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 but you've got to choose again yeah beautiful thanks sis uh, yeah thank you and thank you family yeah. thank you for doing these lessons with us often I feel, you know, especially when I go just about to drift off to sleep at night, I can feel a bunch of you guys just right there in my sacred space, yeah? And it's it's just so beautiful to know that we're not doing this alone, that we're doing it together. So, so beautiful. Yeah. And I'm really enjoying the comments in the YouTube again in, in those when people are sharing their ahas or breakthroughs or they add to the lesson with what they got from it. It's some it's really amazing. So healing. It, it makes all of this, you know, so worth it. I love it. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, that was lesson 292, and we'll see you next time. Yeah. Bye everybody. Bye.